Hello and welcome to Anatomy of Marriage, Marriage Mornings. I'm your host, Melanie Studley. That's right. And my name is Seth Studley and I'm a licensed marriage and family therapist. And we are on day 24 of our Infinity Marriage Challenge. And today's title is Check In. So we're going to check check in with how our marriage mornings are going. Um, But before we do that, if you're new here, welcome. We have 100 episodes about various topics that are long format. But this is our marriage morning format, 10 minutes to love. <laughs> 10 minutes to love. I don't um, know about, well, so each sure. day. But we do, sorry. We do four things every single morning. We start out with a prayer, a past gratitude, a future hope, and a daily goal. We do five things. Uh, we also brush our teeth. One of us didn't remember to this do This podcast that. is over. Anyway, so let me start with all prayer. Right, all right, go for it. Dear Jesus, thank you for all that you've given us. Help us, God, to take those gifts and turn them into goodness in the world, God. And that is all I ask. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Yesterday, I was thankful that we got... Past gratitude. Yes, past gratitude. I was thankful that we got to sled, Mm -hmm. that we got to hang out last night. Mm -hmm. And there was one other thing that was really nice that you did, and I don't remember, but I'm thankful for it. Perfect. Good job. I was also very thankful for sledding. It's basically one of my favorite things. Mm -hmm. I was also very thankful for Incredibles 2. It was fun to watch that. Yeah. And just chill and hang out. All Um, right. Future Hope today. We still have a lot to do to record and get ready for events down in Dallas Mm -hmm. and looking forward to working on that with you. I hope that we get our kids' haircut. Oh yeah, that's a future hope. That's a hope I have. Okay, and my goal today (laughs) is be as positive as possible and be happy first myself and then that kind of flows out of me. Mm -hmm. Yes, me too. I want to have, my goal is to be positive, kind, loving, encouraging, Mm -hmm. pretty much everything I haven't been for most of our marriage. But you're doing good. Um, oh, gosh. Ooh, your phone um, tap. So, uh, like I said, our <clears throat> title for today's episode is Check In. And we're checking in with ourselves, but also with y'all. And to see how your marriage mornings are going. Mm-hmm. But first, let's start with us. With All me. Right. With um, individually or as a couple? Both. Right. So, the first thing I wanted to ask us is how has marriage mornings impacted our marriage? What's your thought about that? It puts goals and intention front and center because we're also accountable to literally thousands of people now and that is a good thing it's become a routine just like we eat breakfast just like we do other stuff to get ready for the day we do marriage mornings Mm -hmm. so it's helped yeah um i think that it has impacted our marriage in a bunch of different ways because i find that because we're accountable to sharing it Mm -hmm. which I would really encourage you guys, please share your marriage mornings. Not because we're weird and want to know what y'all are doing, but because it makes you accountable in a new way. It takes it to a totally different level. And when we know that we have to do these every morning or that we get to do these every morning, it makes me think about the night before Mm -hmm. the stuff I'm going to talk about the next morning. So I am thinking about... Oh, what are we going to pray about? What am I thankful for? What future hope thing do I have? And what goal do I have for mm-hmm. tomorrow? So it not it's not just a thing that happens in the morning when, you get, when you're actually sharing it. It's like a, it becomes sort of a plot point throughout your day where mm-hmm. it reminds you of the intentionality that you have. So it, It's in the it. back of your mind. It's not it's just... in the front of mine. <laughs> it's in the front or back or your entire mind. And the wheels are always turning, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Yeah. so I I think it's impacted our marriage in lots of ways. And one of the biggest ways is that it it helps us think intentionally about what we want and how we want to treat one another um, more frequently. Mm -hmm. So uh, Mm -hmm. what about, what's your favorite part about marriage mornings? My favorite part about marriage mornings is just getting to do this with you. Like if I'm talking about it and we're, you know, you know, engaged in it, then it's present. It's right here in front. And it really helps me to, oops, I'm not in front of the camera, am I? (laughs) It helps me to... It just lays the groundwork, I guess, Mm -hmm. and it's helpful. It's intentional, and I'm not just. What's your favorite part? That was the question, though. Being intentional about it. Being intentional. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, My favorite part, I I think personally, like what what gives me the feels is when Mm. we talk about our past gratitudes. I don't know Mm -hmm. why it just it makes me have like a, a just a really good feeling like a fluttery heart kind of feeling of like yeah. this is good like we are doing something that changing that's changing our marriage and and sometimes you'll think of things that are, you're thankful for that I didn't even notice that I did mm-hmm. and so it's just really it's such a positive and good feeling and that's so it's an encouragement to you yeah it's encouraging but it's also just like 
uh, it feels good. Mm -hmm. It's like a warm cup of coffee Ooh. in the early morning sunshine. Sometimes late at night, I wish I had already <laughs> Art, gone to I sleep know. just so I can wake up. I think about it all the time. I wish there was <laughs> night coffee. Ooh. Decaf might not cut it's it. It's not the same thing. No. But no, anyway, okay. um, why should couples do this? They should do this because it actually helps your marriage. Again, like I said before, you're not just floating through wishing, oh, I wish we had a good marriage, or I wish we communicated better, or I wish we were more intimate, or I wish mm -hmm. we you know, had better conversation. You can wish all you want, but until you put your feet in front of you and do something, then nothing happens, yeah. right? So that's why you should do this, couple. That's why you should do this, oh, husband. That's why you should do this, wife. You know, and even if you're not in a position to do this with your with your partner, you can do it individually, mm -hmm. and that Start is where there. Yeah. <clears throat> that is where I think the rubber really uh, hits the road, meets, meets the, the road. Ru rubber thing goes on the thing. So <laughs> that's that's where it really counts. Do it for yourself. May may your change start from inside and then go out towards your spouse. Mm -hmm. And that's really where it counts. So yeah. that's absolutely why you should do this. I think that couples should do this because it has brought so much more joy and sort of like a, a teamwork mentality into our marriage that mm -hmm. is genuine and sort of runs much deeper than what we have ever previously had. Do you agree mm -hmm. with that? Or? Yeah, because we do the same thing every day. And let we me have a tasked thing every day. <laughs> Yeah, Can I a... say my answer? Oh, yeah, sorry. I also think couples should do this because... I'm just kidding. I just wanted to keep talking. Go no, ahead. Nice. What are you going to say? <laughs> well, let me give you a huge caveat, and I'm really big on this as a, as a person, as a counselor, as a therapist, as a human, right? We absolutely don't have it all together, and we're not trying to say that we do. Forever, I would listen to a podcast or whatever, or a book, or listen to some authority figure say something, and be like, oh, well... I I wish I could have it together like they do, or that guy does, or that lady does. And that is not the case. If I don't know what that's called, but I pray and hope that when you watch this, it, it's not it's not all great and fun all the time. It takes it, hard work. It takes hard work, right? So don't use this podcast as a, oh, well, they're here and this. No. Are you kidding? I can probably look at you and your marriage and go, oh, wait a minute. Well, they have that. They're doing this. And it's the, the, the uh, trap of comparison don't do that because it's not helpful at all yeah i don't know what you're talking i'm just saying about, i have to I we have don't to have it all the caveat our there. kids are literally fighting in the hallway right now That's, um see <laughs> but i do think that couples should do this like i said it's caused us to have deeper levels of joy trust for one another um a, a healthy sort of codependence and consideration of one another it's just really 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 helpful and mm -hmm. changed us a lot in great ways mm -hmm. um, the last thing that I wanted to say before we close is that if you're finding this helpful even just listening to it um, please 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 share marriage mornings with your uh, married community like mm -hmm. at your church your small married groups and your friends there is right. nothing I really hope that you're not ashamed about trying to make your marriage better or improve your relationship and that you wouldn't be ashamed to share this stuff. But not, I mean, I just think it has so much value. It's such an easy thing. We're going to do it anyway. Mm -hmm. So please, please, please share this with your family, your church group, your friend group, your work coworkers. Mm -hmm. um, it brings a depth of joy and happiness and hope that nothing else that I've ever done with you has. Mm. And so I just would really encourage you to share this, not because we care about the numbers, not because we're greedy for whatever, but because this brings change. And again, also record your marriage mornings, make a little audio clip and send it to, call us on the phone. We have a phone number. I don't know we what it is. Oh, number. nope, can't come in. Okay. Um, call us, send us your marriage mornings, send us your videos, post them on uh, Instagram and Facebook, use hashtag marriage mornings, and do these things with us. All right. All right. You got this. Have an amazing day. Bye. Bye.